grocery store. I am uploading this video on a Sunday, and y'all all know that I do not go to church. I sit on my porch just like this, and I chill, or I'm in the bed, or I'm doing meaningful things besides going to go sit in somebody's church and listen to lies. But I was at the grocery store today, and as I'm walking through the aisles, I come across this little um, this end cap that has wine on it. And what drew my attention not only was the wine, but there was a church business card tucked in the wine. Picture will be here. And so that just came, you know, and brought everything full circle. It's like, why does the church have to guilt trip people into coming in? Like, if it's such a natural thing and such a, I don't know, instilled in us to, to go to church, why do you have to go out into the community and evangelize or knock on people's doors and bother them to spread the goodness of the Lord? Like, if it was naturally in us, such as basic things to survive as a human being, such as you get hungry, you go eat, you feel that pain in your stomach, you go to the bathroom, or, you know, just, just simple things that are in our nature to do. Church, religion, Jesus, none of that is in our nature to do, but they go out and just bother us. They are freaking illegal solicitors. And hold on, I, I don't think my camera is clean. I think that's better <laughs> yeah it helps if you clean your camera but when you come to needing the church you don't need that you were born with uh, with all the senses you were born complete with all the you know abilities and stuff like that that you need to survive why did they make it a point to go out into the community and bring it to the people that's like bringing, I don't know, spam and other stuff that we don't need to us. Hey, Bye, sweetie. Station, you have to go. Bye, sweetie. I'm leaving out too, okay? See you later. <laughs> and so, yeah, I'm just at a point like, that really irked me that they would come and put their church business card where the wine is. Because, they, well, I guess it's clever. I guess it's clever. Because didn't didn't Jesus turn water into wine? So I guess that was the synopsis behind it. But also too, they also put a business card where the baby food was. So I guess that's another attempt to get people to church using the 414 window. Bring impressionable infants and newborns and toddlers into the church so yeah that kind of irked me so i saw a meme that somebody had just tagged me and it's like after all this knowledge that we continue to share y'all still take your asses to church check out my playlist up here you know why i left christianity why i left christianity and i'm never going back you know uh, somebody just commented that they subscribed to my channel after watching the video holy hoes beta males and other failures in the church check out my, my video about the 414th window and with our families being so indoctrinated it's like we hold no wealth the most wealthiest thing that we hold to in our possession is a old raggedy bible and belief in jesus so yeah i'm like okay really really are you serious so I talked about Jesus Christ being the holy home wrecker. You know, I talked about reconnecting with my family last year. Within six months, they divorced me again because I do not subscribe to their Jesus. It's some bullshit, you know? Fuck Jesus, fuck them, and fuck religion, okay? But yeah, this is a public service announcement. Put my, fo my phone in the little hook so I don't drop it down here. Yeah, but after this public service announcement, after all this knowledge I spread, and after y'all see me, I'm still living, breathing. My turtleneck is a little messed up, but I ain't burning in hell. And the thing of it is, if I'm going to hell, if some of the people who claim they're going to heaven going there, I'd rather go to hell anyway. So, yeah, I hope you stay your ass in the house today. Save your tithes money. Save your time and do some, something productive, okay? Quit taking your ass to church and sit up there listening to lies, listening to pastors sleep around sister hoochie mama and her badass fucking kids and all that bullshit so this is your girl taisha make sure you subscribe to my youtube channel 
go ahead and join me on my other social media platforms Twitter, Vero, Instagram, all that other stuff, okay? Visit my website, TaishaEssex.com. Become a Patreon. Hit a sister up in the inbox. Talk to y'all later.